gunpowder can be used for a lot of recipes in Minecraft. Most notable are the rockets and TNT. So today I will show you how to build a gunpowder farm in just 10 seconds, 1 minute and 10 minutes. Starting off with the 10 second farm. Here are the items needed for this method. It's also pretty compact as you can see. But now to the farm, as you can guess it isn't really possible to build a creeper farm in just 10 seconds. So this is more of a method or so. First you need to find a nice and open plains biome. And the reason for this is that in the plains biome you can see much further away than in any other biomes. And the mobs will also have more spawning space here. Once you have your plains biome picked out, find the highest point in the area and pull up the timer. Place at least 128 scaffoldings here on top of each other. Let's see if I can make it just in time and whew, that was pretty close. And now let's climb up. Once we are at the top, you just have to wait for the night. And now that it's night time, let's go back down. As you can see, there are a ton of mobs all around you. Now just run around and kill all the creepers. Make sure to also use a looting sword. Once you can't find any more creepers, go back up to the tower and come back down. Since the tower is 128 blocks high, once you are up there, all the mobs on the ground will despawn, because you are too far away. This also works with an elytra if you happen to have one. And once you are coming back down, a fresh batch of creepers will spawn all around you, so you can just keep on killing them. I will do this for the whole night and show you the results after. So as you can see, we got exactly 35 gunpowder in one night, which makes the hourly rate about 100 gunpowder. And that's pretty bad to be honest, since we had to be active for the whole time. But if you want to AFK, then the next farm will help us. And that is the 1 minute creeper farm. Here are all the items you will need for this farm, and also the area that it uses. And the first step is to find a nice spot for a farm. I recommend a small island for example. This way you only have to spawn proof a small area. We also need a cat for this farm. So once we have the cat on our island, let him sit down somewhere in the middle of the island. And now we can start building the farm. Starting the timer and let's get building. Start off with the two blocks high walls in a shape like this. Make sure the cat is also in the middle right next to the wall. Once the walls are done, add a roof with top trap doors, but leave one row empty on the side without the cat. And finally, cover everything with slabs, so no mobs can spawn on top of your farm. Once this is done, break a couple of blocks to get inside, and add 6 carpets like this. Next, let's dig a 3 deep hole right here. We gotta be quick if we want to make it. Place a chest hopper and a soul campfire right here and then add a row of trap doors. Lastly add the water and time. That was really close. And if the build tutorial was too fast for you, the word download will be in the description below. The farm may be complete, but we are not done just yet. Let's close off this hole we made earlier and dig a small hole to access the chest. Also we gotta place down some ladders to get out. Now light up the area around the farm to spawn proof it, and we are pretty much done. Finally, let's just get to the AFK platform, and for that you have to be on top of the farm and add a slab somewhere in the middle. On top of this slab, place exactly 121 scaffoldings. And easy as that, your AFK spot and the farm is completely done. I will do a 1 hour AFK test now to show how much this farm actually produces. It's been an hour, let's check it out. We got exactly 90 gunpowder. That is alright for such a small farm I guess. But don't worry, because the next farm will produce a lot more gunpowder than this 1 minute farm. Introducing the 10 minute farm. Here are all the items needed for this farm, and also the area you need to build it. First, find yourself a nice island that is at least 20 by 20 blocks big. I should also mention that this farm needs exactly 4 cats. So once we have our cats on the island, let's pull up the timer and start building. First we need to start building the walls. 
Follow the pattern I'm showing here and make sure the walls are two blocks high. Now that the walls are done, we need to dig a 2x3 hole. After that, place a trapdoor next to the longest wall like this and do it on both sides. And once they are done, start by making the roof with trapdoors. Cover everything except the middle 6 blocks and make sure that the roof is flush with the walls. Now that we have our roof ready, let's place 6 carpets on both sides. This prevents the spiders from spawning. After that, dig the middle 2 blocks deeper and let's go forward a bit as well. Here, place down your chest, 2 hoppers and 2 soul campfires as well. Go back a bit and add 6 trap doors like this. After which you can add water right here. And the bottom portion of the farm is pretty much done. Now we can get the cats in. Use a lead and then drag them in. Or just bait and push them if you don't have a lead in hand. And now the farm is basically done. We just need to cover the top with some blocks. But since we have plenty of time left, we can make a second floor to double the production rates. For that just cover the top with building blocks and build the same wall layout we built before. Then add the trap doors for cats and carpets to prevent the spiders from spawning. Don't forget to add the 6 trap doors in the middle as well. Once all of this is done, cover everything except the middle 6 blocks with trap doors. Now another 2 cats go in the same place as below. And the final step is to make a roof. Make it out of slabs so no mobs can actually spawn on it. After the roof is done, go in the middle here and add another slab just like this. And on top of that one exactly 118 scaffoldings. This is your AFK platform. We are getting pretty close to the finish line. Now just add a way to access your chests, for example with some ladders. And finally the torches, so no mobs can actually spawn around your farm making it as efficient as possible. And your farm is done, easy as that and we even got some time left. But how good is this farm? Well I will now do a 1 hour AFK test to see how much gunpowder we can produce. The 1 hour is up and let's see how much gunpowder it generated. Surprisingly, exactly 666 gunpowder in just an hour. That is really nice for such an easy and quick farm. And you could get even more by just building more layers on top of this farm. If you are still playing Minecraft alone, then check out Wise Hosting and host a high quality Minecraft server for you and your friends. Link is down below. See you in the next one.